hey guys welcome back to my channel so today i'm going to show you the how to read the report so this is the report uh, i have created in the last uh, tutorials which is you can see here the project name is school project sample vrf system okay and uh, this report is uh, the air system output report here is the air system information which is ground floor vrf system equipment class is a terminal unit air system type is vrf number of zone is one floor area is three six three nine square feet total floor area and location is new delhi india sizing calculation is calculation for the month of january to december and uh, in the next page you can see the zone sizing summary so here is the your zone sizing so zone one the total zone is here the result is uh, the output result is in english system so i want uh, i want in a matrix system here you can see the terminal unit sizing data zone for the heating and this is for the cooling okay so total coil load is uh, 174 mbh so let us uh, convert into the tonnage so 174.8 into 1000 divided by 12000 14.5 ton the total load is 14.5 ton and here the vrf outdoor unit sizing data so here the peak coincidence indoor unit load on 61.2 cooling coil tonnage is 13.4 heating is 50.9 the total required outdoor capacity is 161 which is in 10 is 13.4 with outdoor unit and the VRF piping line loses are based on the typical loss vector the class of equipment so here is the peak zone peak sensible load in the peak time there will be load for this zone and the space load for and airflow for the each spaces here uh, the cooling sensible load and uh, the airflow is given here as well and next uh, your uh, report is a system design load summary which is uh, for the conduction thermal conduction and radiation the transmission load is given here and here is uh, ventilation load is not given so we want ventilation load as well so let me open this software and i want uh, the report in metric system so where is uh, this one let me open this where it is uh, ah, here is school project sample vrf system okay let me open this okay and uh, just go to this uh, view preferences i want to change the unit so i want in english metric system save it and then go to this system and uh, select this and generate the report okay so i want the ventilation sizing summary as well so let me check this and generate the report so here you can see the report is in kilowatt already here let me save this next step click this one ground floor here report and which is in metric system metric save this then go to this here is the metric system let me open this like where you go now you can see this is the floor area is in a square meter which is in metric system total coil load is 51.2 kilowatt which is equal to 
51.2 divided by 3.51 14.5 kilowatt 14.5 ton approximate same and here is the total coil load for the outdoor unit space load and air flows the classroom one is 7.9 kilowatt and air flow is 572 so this is information we have to update here here in this load schedule okay so next you you can see this is the space ventilation load sizing summary which is uh, nothing but the the fresh air requirement sum of out a space of outdoor airflow zone one which is here you can see the required uh, uncorrected outdoor air which is uh, the fresh air is required here total 615 liter per second here the number of people and the maximum air flow the cfm floor area and number of people and here supplier the here is the record outdoor liter per second per person liter per second per square meter and this is the outdoor requirement outdoor air you can check here as well this is ventilation load 616 liter per second same will be here 616 liter per second so this is how it looks like how to read this uh, vrf system project report and how to create this so the same information we have to update here okay in this uh, and then we have to select the equipment so i hope you guys learn something from this video so please be with me and uh, keep watching my video in the next uh, tutorials i will uh, show you the next step which is uh, calculate the fresh air calculation so already no need to calculate because already i have calculated here in this uh, using this software so the second step is also over now dividing the building into the zone so no need to divide because the our project is for the only one zone which is ground floor the one floor building now next four and fourth step is place uh, the indoor and outdoor and do the piping so this step we have to do now before this we have to update this uh, equipment selection so please be with me and keep watching my video so thank you for watching my video thank you bye bye